Okay, guys, welcome back to Alan Wake Part 2. We're on a barge. There must be. Oh. Let's act like okay. we're on vacation. Go stand next to that old gentleman there. I want a shot of you. Hang on. The <laughs> sure. I'll even give you a title for the shot A City Boy. Moments before he got eaten by a bear. Hang on. One second, bear. You don't own me. Is there blood in that truck? What the juice? Pose for Alice. Alan, Is this the guy? Shot. Okay. I don't think it's him. <laughs> Call me a yup. Where's the old guy? Oh, I can't move. Oh, hey, that car looks familiar. Come on, baby. There. You picked a good time to visit our town. Deerfest is just two weeks away. Deerfest, huh? Did That's you hear nice. that, honey? You have a lovely wife. If you don't mind me saying. I'm Pat Main, by the way. Nice to meet you. Yeah, I'm Alan Wake. I won't pretend I don't recognize a famous writer such as yourself, oh, Mr. Oh, oh. Wake. A pleasure. I'm an avid reader nice. myself. I hope this isn't too presumptuous of me, but I'm the night host at the local radio station. Any chance I could get an interview? Look, Mr. Maine, I'm on vacation. In fact, I'd appreciate it if we could keep my being here just between the two of us. I'm sure you understand. Fair enough, Ryan. You can trust me to be discreet. Not a hard man to track down if you change your mind, though. I hope you two have a lovely holiday. He seems creepy. Get a photos there, Alice? Huh? Very huh? nice. Huh? I got a couple of really good ones. And I see you made a friend. That's <laughs> cute. Right. Damn it, Alan. Yeah? Hey, I gotta Barry take Taylor? this. That was my favorite writer. Are you there yet? Barry. Yeah. We just got him. Are the locals giving you trouble? Just say the word and I'll hop on a plane and come make sure that you're left alone, Al. No, Barry, we're fine. Great, great. Just want to make sure you can relax and recharge. So, how is the place? Has it gotten your creative juices flowing? Barry, we're just settling in. Okay, Al. I'll call back later to make sure you're doing okay. And you call me if there's a problem, okay? Okay. I'm just looking out for you, buddy. Talk to you later. I love you too, Barry. <laughs> you know... Oh. Sorry. He's going to be calling you every five minutes. Barry is Barry. I can always turn off the phone. What did I tell you? Text message from Barry. He says hi to you, too. Is there something you want to tell me, Alice? Alan, we're here. Come on, let's get mm. back to the car. I didn't think so. Can I drive, please? Damn it. Cutscene. We need to stop at the local diner to get the cabin key from the landlord. A Mr. Carl Stuckey. He's waiting for us. I'll go fill her up while you get the key. I'll pick you up here in, say, 15 minutes? Sure. Alan, thank you for coming here with me. I love you, too. Go on. I'll promise to behave. Oh, 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 okay. You player, Alan. I'd forgotten there were still places like this. Towns where everybody knew everybody. Welcome to the Oh Dear Diner. Hi, I was wondering if you could help me. I'm looking for... Mr. Wake. Alan Wake. Oh, God! I am your biggest fan. I know people say that all the time, but I really am. I'm glad to hear that. Rose. Rose. I'm looking for Mr. Stuckey. Carl Stuckey? Carl? Of course, Mr. Wake. He must have gone to visit the rest Ew. of you. He'll be back in a moment. I can't believe it. I've got all your books. I got the cutout from the bookstore when they took it out of the window. Uh, right. So much for a quiet vacation. <laughs> and you keep it here. Well, okay. Good for you. I want food. There must be a thermos here. Try the coffee. Just don't blame me when you fall in love, because it'll break your heart. There's you one. Have to leave. Rusty here is no longer human. Nothing but black coffee under a thin layer of skin. Yeah, that makes two of us. Bloop, 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 da, 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 da. Are you staying oh, with us, bro? Do me a favor, Sonny. I could really use a tune right now. 
Coconut number six in the jukebox. I'd do it myself, but both of my legs have gone to sleep. Bad circulation. Yeah. Are you serious? Coconut again? You disgust no. me. Call yourself Thank you. a rocker. Unbelievable. <laughs> what the flip? Hello? Are you okay? Don't go in there, young man. You can hurt yourself in the dark. I think I can handle it, ma'am. I didn't want to wait. I wanted to find Stucky to get the key and get out as soon as possible. The waitress was giving me a headache. Overeager fans always did. Uh oh. Something's gonna happen. We go here. Damn. Hello? <clears throat> Mr. Stucky? Oh my. Carl couldn't make it. Unfortunately, he was taken ill. What the heck? But I have the key for you and instructions on how to get to the lake. Okay. I wish you a good stay in my cabin. I'll come by later to check how you've settled in. And to meet your wife. I insist. What the heck? Thanks. What the f Can I like shoot her with my laser gun? Cauldron Lake is a special place. Very inspiring. It's GTFO. You got lucky this time, young man. You can hurt yourself in the dark. You turn the this really ought to be fixed, and then I must remind Sarah to change the lights at the station. It's been too long. Even that sounds better than your singing. Are you all right? <laughs> splendid, splendid. <laughs> Damn hernia. It swells up like a balloon if I lift anything heavier than a spoon. Yep. The Andersons, they're uh, local musicians. We're waiting for Dr. Hartman to come pick them up. They wandered off from his clinic at the Cauldron Lake Lodge. The heck? Something's fishy. And it's not the fresh seafood. Ha <laughs> ha. I was good timing. Bye, Mr. Wake. Mission accomplished. The key and the directions. My hero. I got some flashlights, uh -oh. just in case. Four shot him in there. Hey, wait! Mrs. Wake! Your... Your keys! Keys for what? That diner was a real nut house. <laughs> Can you believe this place? This would make a wonderful setting for a book. We're supposed to be on vacation, Alice. I'll figure it out when we get back home. Okay? Okay, we can talk about this later. This is very, um... I didn't want to talk about it. I wanted to bury my head in sand. So, Once upon a time, I was a successful writer. But that was a long time ago. I hadn't been able to write a word in two years. Not since my last book. And now the weather. It's gonna be a clear night, so you folks in the big city might want to look up every once in a while. Those stars winking down at you. It gets pretty dark out here, but they'll light your way. Yay, montage. Ugh. There's not much really going on this episode, is there? Ah. Diver's Isle. Cool. Wow. It's yeah, it really is. Else. It's something, all right. Don't worry, I'll get you inside safe and sound before it gets dark. And I've got Yay. the flashlight. No, I'm okay. Alice had a phobia. The fear of darkness. I wanted to make sure we were inside with the lights on before sunset. Don't fall in, Alice. Be a shame if someone pushed you. Are you sure you read the directions right? It's nothing like in the brochure. It said near the lake, not on it. Don't get me wrong. This is so much better. It's wonderful. Bird leg. It's my crows here.
East, 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 east. More crows. Ah, come on, Alice. Yeah, take it, chair. Take it. Here we go. Let's take a look inside. Yay. It's dark in there. We need light. Right Can you figure out how to get the power? Yeah. Because I'm a man. Ooh, what's this? A shoebox filled with books by Thomas Zane sat on the shelf. I'd never heard of him before. Hello? Anyone here? Yay, Flask. East, east. This is pretty creepy. Oh, did I turn the bar on? Let's that examine something there. The power cable goes to that shelf. Oh, thanks, Alice. I should sure fucking help. The shed. Okay. Do, 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 do. Hello, crew. The island had once been the site for a love story. Maybe it would be that again. Hmm. I'm thinking it will be. <gasps> what the heck? Oh. An old generator had been connected to the power cable. Stuck this bitch. <laughs> These sweet quick time click things are pretty cool. Is that it? The lights are on. Good work, honey. I'll freshen up a bit and start settling <laughs> in. Okay. I'll look around a bit. Sure thing. Have fun. I will. I will have fun. It was a beautiful place. I told myself I could rest here. Sleep here and forget about my work. <laughs> I thought we could be happy here. <laughs> oh. Can we not? Huh? Can we not be happy? Uh, let me see here. Now I'm gonna stop this one here, guys. Um, I'll see you in the next episode.